Hey everyone, it is Saturday night and date night. The kids are out at an event together, which is nice. We have the house all to ourselves and we can do really fun and crazy grown up things. So this is what we're doing. We are going to watch a little TV, but we have this amazing cheese spread. We just ran to the grocery store. We have Dubliner Kerrygold Cheddar. Grand, Ch oh shoot, babe, do you remember what this one was called? It's really stinky French cheese. Grand Chamay, Chamay, Chamay's, something like that. Uh, Jarlsberg, Brie, double cream Brie, Havarti, we have some Soprasada, some prosciutto, Irish, Irish, Dorset Red, and then that's a Gouda. Yeah, there's Irish Stout in that. We have some wild honey, or raw honey over there. And then we have sparkling water. Very exciting. And then the funny, the most funny part is they, I swear they can smell the cheese through the door. They want in so bad. So babe, why don't you go guard and I will let them in. Let date night commence. Hey everyone, we are walking down the streets of San Antonio. Um, the kids and I don't have work today technically, but or school for them, but my husband did. So uh, he took our oldest down with him to do some work. My oldest one could use the quiet in the office to get some homework done. And my younger one and I came down at lunchtime to meet them for lunch. So we are walking to the restaurant on the Riverwalk. And I'm not used to walking on street level down here. Usually we're, we're walking on the river level. But here we go. I'm getting nasty looks from my son. So I, my, my, I got it. My purse is... Alright, they're very concerned. I'm going to get mugged in this very high crime area. <laughs> Not, all right, check out the view. Hey everyone, we're at one of my favorite restaurants in downtown San Antonio, it's called Asenar, which is attached to the Hotel Valencia right here on the Riverwalk. It's a little chilly outside, so we decided to sit inside. And the cool part is that I can't, you can't see him, but up there, the guys from ZZ Top are having lunch. How cool is that? That is pretty cool. Anyway, we're, us normal people are going to get back to our lunch and I'll show you my lunch when it gets here. Okay, lunch is here. We don't eat like this every day, as you know. This is a lot, but here are my enchiladas verdes and fajitas. And my husband's fajitas are mushroom and calabacitas, which are really cool. And tea, can't ever have enough iced tea. All right, so lunch is over. ZZ Top is gone, and we are walking the river. It's my favorite part. It's the part where the tourists don't go, so I'll show you what I can see. Hello, river people. That's the back of my oldest son's head. That's about as much of the as you're going to see on camera. Okay, we have walked the river from the restaurant. We're almost at my husband's office, but you got to see this view. You've seen this in other vlogs from street level, but here we are coming from the river level. The Tobin Center for Performing Arts. Here's the river. There are my kids. There's a hotel. And here's the Tobin Center from this side. So pretty. Oh look, this is for the Congressional Medal of Honor. That is so nice. Oh wow. So there's the Tobin Center, which is the Center for Performing Arts here in San Antonio, which is has had a facelift. Isn't she pretty? Hey everyone, it is Tuesday. Yes, it is. I just mailed some packages and sent all the rest of the label requests off for those of you that already have Zoya Marnie but needed a new label that was spelled correctly. Those are on your on their way to you now. Um, and now I'm off to pick up the computer. Can you believe I just dropped it off on Thursday and it's ready to be picked up already and it was less than $200 to fix, which is 
not inexpensive but way less than a new computer so I'm very happy about that so let's go off and then I also have to run to the alterations place because my son popped off a button on his suit jacket I don't even know how you do that um, and he has cotillion on Saturday which is not as foo-foo as it sounds it's really just a big party for a thousand kids middle schoolers so that's that and um, anyway so I'm off and it is currently you got to see this because you're not gonna believe it yeah, 76 degrees. What? Cray cray, as they say. Crazy. Hey everyone, I am going to be out for a dinner meeting um, tonight, but I wanted a pre-make dinner for the family and just usual taco night, which I haven't shown you how I make tacos because I just brown meat, in this case it's ground turkey, and add a seasoning packet, so not that glamorous. But uh, I thought I would bump it up a notch and make homemade guacamole, specifically the recipe from one of my favorite restaurants here in San Antonio called Boudros, and it requires you to roast serrano peppers. So I'm cutting them up and preparing them to roast. Uh, I have a packet of these latex gloves, or I don't know what kind of plastic gloves, for sunless tanner, but it turns out these are good to have around for when you are cutting up spicy peppers, because if I cut them without these and I get any of the oils from here on my hands and then rub my eyes, it could be disastrous. So gloves. So you never know. I think everyone should just go grab a box of these from your drugstore and have them because you just never know what you could use them for. Sunless tanning, pepper slicing, just a variety of things. Hey guys, I feel like all I do is talk to you in my car. I'm on my way to a lab appointment. I have my regularly scheduled checkup with my endocrinologist next week, but first they want to suck all my blood out and analyze it. Everything's great. There's not been an update because there's nothing to tell you. Um, I feel great. My symptoms are under control. My medication hasn't changed. So if something changes, I will let you all know. But I had some time to kill. I ran into CVS. I had $10 in extra beauty bucks, so $10 off a purchase. Uh, so of course I had to spend it. And I finally got my hands on the L'Oreal Brow Stylist Plumper, which is supposed to be a dupe for the Benefit Gimme Brow, so I will let you know. And then this I saw, this was not on my list. This is new from Milani. They are Milani Fierce Foil Eyeshines. I just got the basic 01. I was debating between, this one's called Milan, and then there's another one called Florence, which is a little warmer in tone, a little deeper, but I thought I'd start with the basic. I just wanted to see what these newfangled foil shadows are all about. So that, that was my little unplanned shopping trip. I really came in there to go find buttons because the buttons I bought for my son's suit jacket yesterday were a quarter of an inch too big. I should have measured before I bought them. So they did not have buttons. It was a long shot. So after my lab appointment, I'll be going to Michael's to see if I can find one there. I'll see you in a bit. Hey everyone, I'm at Michael's. I'm supposed to be here looking for buttons, but I was distracted by all this. Did you all know that they have like home decor stuff here? Because I did not know that. I mean, look at some of these bulletin boards, and the wreaths I knew about, but all this decorative, the faux plants, these cute pillows, there's some funky bulletin board type things. Like this is really cute. It's burlap. I'm getting some ideas, possibly, from my filming room. Just look at all this stuff. I mean, seriously. Did you know about this? I did not know about this. Oh, cute chalk bubbles. That could be fun. Anyway, I'm going to stop here. Oh, those are cute. I'm going to have to digest some of this and figure out what I want to do if I want to buy any of it, but it's good to know it's here. There's some really cute stuff. Hey, I'm at my synagogue and we're getting ready to interview a rabbinical, assistant rabbinical candidate. It's very exciting and you can't see anybody here because that would be rude, but they're all looking at me because I'm showing them what a vlog looks like. So um, for all of y'all watching, watch next Wednesday and you can see me talking about you on um, camera. So I've just finished filming my January face of the month. Here it is. And I want you to see what I am seeing. This is my little setup here. Very professional. And then, this is my um, my little cheering section here. And uh, while I'm dressed from the waist up, I have a dog hair, pajama bottoms, and slippers. That will change. I, I will finish getting dressed now. And uh, I'm gonna head out and have lunch with a subscriber that I met at the Elaine Turner event that we did last September. And, um, 
I'm really excited. We really hit it off. It's just one of those, when you meet someone and you just click, we clicked. So hopefully she will let me film us and she will make an appearance on the vlog. So uh, I will see you guys at lunch. Hey everyone, it is Friday and I'm freezing my little tushy off. Well, it's not so little after the lunch I had, but I'm here with a friend and subscriber, Sydney. Hello. Hi, we are at El Daco's. We forgot to film absolutely everything of our lunch, but... Um, had a great time. It was really fun. Yeah. And now I'm off to, um, where am I going? Office Max? Office Max. Because Sydney said it's cheaper than Staples because I need some office supplies. So this was today's vlog. This is all that you're going to see probably. Um, it's too cold to stand on here and talk. So we're going to say goodbye. Bye. And uh, I'll see you later. Hey guys, it's end of the day Friday and I'm back in the house and I just got this nice little package from Pacifica Natural Beauty. I'm just putting the top of the box back on because I think the box is really cute and I will be saving the box. They reached out to me and asked me if I wanted to try some of their, okay, here's the top. That's what the top looks like. I'll be saving this box because it's just terrible. But anyway, they reached out to me and asked me if I wanted to try some of their products because I'm really not familiar with the brand and I said, sure. So um, they sent me three um, roller balls and three of them. So I have three Tahitian Gardens. Oh, I'm sorry, Tahitian Gardenia, I have three of these. Three Tuscan Blood Orange and three Hawaiian Ruby Guava. I do not need three of each of these scents. So I'm gonna try all of them and then I will be giving away the other ones eventually. Um, and then they sent me their mascara, three again of the same color. So three of their brownish version, which I guess is called Stardust and three of their black one, Supernova. So I will be giving these a go. They are vegan, they're certified by, sorry, PETA, the terrorist organization known as PETA. I'm joking again, guys. Um, and a lot of other awards. So if you've ever tried this brand and have, are familiar at all with any of their products, I would love to get some feedback while I'm playing with them. And of course they will get their own video and I'll tell you all about them and do the giveaway part, but I just, the box just came, so I wanted to show you. And um, I'm really excited. I'm excited about everything, but I'm really excited about the box. I love cool boxes. I know, I'm weird, I'm weird. But anyway, it's uh, the end of the week and I'm just wiped. It's been a really busy week, a lot of late night meetings and getting up early. So I'm gonna call it a week and call it a vlog and um, go hang out with my kids and watch some TV. Maybe get them to watch some broad church with me. And I will see you in the next video. Thanks for watching, bye. There is my version of a very wearable look, I think, from Too Faced and um, the semi-sweet. It's a general makeup look I've been using a lot this